Hello again, um, everyone. Hello from Marshall as well. We're uh, being thrown into the spare room at the moment because um, there's a bit of an argument with the wife. It wasn't an argument really, but she burned the dinner and I was looking forward to that salad. Anyway, now that's, that was a joke. That was a joke. A lot of people have been asking for a post box. I've got it now. It's um, so if you want to send me a Christmas card, it's Frank Music, all in one word. Frank Music, P.O. Box seven three three, Huntingdon. It'll be written down on the description anyway. Huntingdon, P.E. two nine nine, P.F. So that's that. Got that out of the way. Um, a lot of people want to, um, it's, you know, it's a bit weird, people seem to always want to know everything about you, thinking that you're something special, well I can assure you I'm not something special. Um, hey, well talk about posts, the postman this morning, he knocked on my door and he got a parcel, he said I've got a parcel here but the name's all smudged. That's what's not me is it, that's probably the new bloke down the road. Anyway, um, yeah, so here's a little bit of a, I'll do a quick, a quick life story. Because a lot of people say, well, I always sing in sad songs. Well, maybe it's been built into me, I don't know. I just can't do happy stuff. I just, I can't do fast because my fingers are getting old now. I could do a little bit fast, but not, not, I can't do rock. There's electric guitar behind me that I've not touched throughout 30 years. Um, but, um, I was born in uh, the Midlands, in a, like East Anglia, a town near a, a town called Peterborough, which is not far from here actually. And when I was uh, nine, my dad died, some kind of work accident. And so we all moved away up to the north in Lancashire for a new life. And two years later, my mum died. And that was a shock. And then one day we came home from school, about a couple of days later, came home from school and uh, all these cars outside and there were seven of us in our family, seven kids, and it was just all different relatives and they all chose a child and drove off. Uh, and that's about it, that's, that's, my, that's what my song, uh, When I Was A Boy, is basically about. Um, I went to a nice auntie, but, uh, by the age of 16, I, I, I wanted to get back, so we, we, uh, I just left and went back, because my eldest, two eldest brothers were still at the old house, and when I got back, everyone was there, they'd all got back, because you can't keep us apart, you can't split family up, but there were two young ones missing, and we had no idea where they are, because the auntie that took them adopted them to somebody else. Which, uh, so it took a long time, but eventually we got a phone call and we found them all back together. So there's a happy ending. Uh, that's un unlike me. Um, yeah, there's a few things. I've, I'm getting, I've had to re refuse Facebook requests uh, for friend requests because I'm just, I'm, I'm getting so many. And I've already got quite a lot on there of people that I don't actually know, and they never, we never comment or anything. But you, you, you sort of get blocked up with all these posts of other people, and and so because I use basically my Facebook is basically for the people that I see that I know and friends of friends of them, that like you, everyone's little personal group, and um, so. I'm not being horrible, I'm not being all, oh no, I don't need, I don't, I, I, don't, I don't want you to think I'm being stuck up or anything, because I'm not, just in this, it's too much all these friend requests, but what I have got, uh, I don't know if anyone knows, I've only just started it up, and it's a, it's a Facebook group page, and it's called Frank Watkinson Music, that's all it's called, Frank Watkinson Music. And at the moment, I'm just putting all the old songs off YouTube onto it, really. And you can join that. And 
when if I write a new song, it'll probably go on there first, and then later on on YouTube. Um, I don't bother about the reactions because you're closer you're closer to friends they are. <laughs> there's, oh, it's him again. Yeah, oh, so that's just old Frank again. So it's that's there as a group, and it, it's um, you you like Facebook groups. You you ask to join, but it's on auto. It's on auto accept anyway, so anyone can join it. Um, and that's it, that's that bit. Um, yeah, I'm running out of things to say now. Uh, there was something else I was going to say. That, uh, um, oh yes, I've, I've still got, there's a lot of people want me to be their granddad, and like I said, I will be your granddad. Just, just, just assume that I am, uh, if that's how you feel. Uh, I get lots of comments about people saying, um, who disliked this, who disliked that. Well, personally, I've never disliked a video, no matter how bad it is, I can't see the point. I don't know what that gives you. Does that, does that give you a bit of power disliking? But either way, my, I know I'm not for everybody, and someone might watch and go, who, no, you don't dislike it. Um, I wonder if people would dislike if the name came up. I think there might be a different thing. There's a lot of people at night, but it doesn't bother me. I'm too old to let that bother me. So when people say, "Oh, don't," who did this? I'd like to get them. Just let it be. Just let it be. Um, uh, and that's about it for for now. I'm, it, I, I've never done. Uh, a guitar tutorial but I've got it here so I'm going to do another one in a minute just a quick one someone someone wants to know how, how I do in the aeroplane over the sea I can tell you that, you to, that tutorial will last about 30 seconds because that's all <laughs> I'm not very good and I, I've told people before there's no nothing fancy in what I do so that won't take long to do that but it'll keep them happy do you like to keep people happy uh, uh, and that's about it. I think I'll end with a little, a little joke. Everyone has, um, Marshall. What are you doing? Everyone has. Come in, come in. Ah! Watch this one. He like, he likes this one. Everyone has a favourite joke, and there's one joke that makes me just. I can't. I always laugh at it, and you've probably heard it, but it's still funny. And it's uh, the English football team have got an away game in the World Cup somewhere deep in the in in the South America, really down deep. So they get in the plane and they go. And they're going over the Amazon rainforests, and the engines cut out. And they're down, and they've got the trackers on it, and they know where it is. And they go, oh my God, that's deep in the jungle. And we still think there are cannibals living in the jungle. So they send out a search team, but they can't fly or anything there, so they have to trudge through the jungle and try to find the, the, where they are. And after seven days, they get to where they are, and they're really worried about the football team because of these cannibals. And they get into the clearing, and there's all the cannibals. And instantly, they can see that they're too late. The cannibals have eaten all the football team and they're just warming up the substitute. <laughs> anyway, that's my favourite that's my favourite joke. Yeah, what was that? No, that's not no. He wants and what is it? He wants to tell the, his joke and that uh, what he says the dog next door can do magic tricks. What is he then? He's a labracadabrador. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you later. Thanks, thanks everybody for kindness. Thanks a lot.